Today, this is the Bugatti Chiron Interceptor Unit, and we have zero days left to get it. Now, luckily, I have level 50 on the motor pass. Don't worry, we just made it. And so, without further ado, let's jump in and experience everything left this update has, because tomorrow... Oh, ho, ho, ho. of course, I'm actually making this after they've announced what is coming. So, of course, we can talk about it. There's a whole slew of new cars. And this Hyperway Pursuit is, is first on my list. First thing is we're going to throw 320 parts all over the machine. And we're going to complete the final event that is left. Then tomorrow, there's going to be a whole slew of brand new events for us to check out. You already know that's exactly what we're going to do. Oh, this looks menacing. This looks so menacing. It looks so wide at the rear as well. Like, is it is it wider than the normal Bugatti? Let's go final run Rolling. of this update. And it looks beautiful. <laughs> How are you not dead? Get him, get him. Oh, come on. You both should be. You should both be toast in the Kaiser Whip. That's actually... That counted as me. These cars, this car, the Kaiser machine is available in the next episode you're able to to buy it and i think it's unlocked through the motor pass and it's called creator cars and it makes me think like come on allow me to design a car i can't they even they even they even go there it's just not gonna <laughs> it's not gonna happen it's not gonna be pretty oh come on one left to go we're going to smash it in good time, unless this final one here takes an unwillingly crazy amount of time. No, you should be dead! The hypercars are so much beefier. Now, the focus of the next one is off-road police chases. I was hoping for the possibility that we would get, instead of that, I didn't think we were going to get that. I was hoping that we would do the chasing. But of course, it's not just the motor pass that comes. It's going to be a whole slew of new things. There's going to be a whole new bunch of cars for us to buy tomorrow. From the get-go, I'm very much looking forward to that. Mute my mic. I always forget to do that. I wonder if people can actually hear me yapping away. Let's jump in and customize this boy. Now, of course, I want to go for a livery. It has now been the whole time. That people have been able to unlock this. So, of course, we're going to see exactly what people come up with. A fully blacked out machine in gloss. I do like my gloss better than my matte. We've got the normal Bugatti style. In case you want to do the Bugatti, it's very nice. And, of course, we've got the Dubai police. Not too shabby. Normal police. And, of course, most of these are just going to be different variants of the type of police. I don't realize how many vanity wheels that I have now. That's a lot of wheels. Which is all good. We're going for the green and green on the, the flamey flames too. Of course, I'm, ho like, I'm hoping there's any little details in the next update. We need custom plates. That's something I keep moaning about. That's something I'm going to be moaning about until the deed is done. So that is all of the chase events completed. Of course, I haven't maxed these out. Now, my question is, are these going to go away? Is that it? Is all of this stuff gone? Of course, anything in the motor pass is now going vamos. Let's jump into the summit and quickly see. This is the current summit. I didn't find any point in doing it, to be honest with you. And apparently, neither did a bunch of the community. 1.1 million, which is really not that high. But of course, there's, J there's no reward in here that's really worth the time as such. But tomorrow, we've got the Enforcer HX Concept. And of course, the Vault Interceptors. Again, these two summits seem completely pointless to be honest with you we've got carnage lovers which we can't actually see so that is something to look out for and we're also going to get some brand new vanity items for sure but currently right now there's literally nothing that i want for sale right now it's dead in here we are needing this update pretty soon i mean obviously that's why it's tomorrow now here's something i thought i would throw into this video just to kind of discuss make a discussion point because i know a lot of you guys in the comments don't even use this timeline anymore because I personally have, as you can clearly see, it's been a long time since I bothered to be here. So why don't they make it in here that we unlock crew credits? I think that would be a nice way. Of course, for those people that play the game consistently, like ridiculous amounts, we've got all these levels to unlock, but all we get is parts. And clearly I haven't bothered to use them. So should... 
crew credits be added into here for maybe every like 500 levels or maybe 200 levels something ridiculous but it would make it worth it you know these are actually the two police units we're gonna be unlocking first a beautiful escalade and of course the ford raptor evo one enforcer unit very nice so these are enforcer units which is different to the interception units i i, I guess that kind of makes sense but then we've also got these beautiful machines thank the lord the 3000 gt we've seen it plotting around in the game but now we're actually going to be able to use it in the game and i'm very very excited for it and of course the new motor pass which shows us there's an interceptor version of it in case you don't want to buy it you cheap i'm kidding or <laughs> you can get the kaiser slim car which is part of the free motor pass which I'm very, I'm very glad that they did that. Oh, this looks so spicy. I love the single light bar across the back. Boom, baby! Oh! I had to give it a go in the Dubai-themed machine. This man just stopped it. I want to get back on the event because I want to do it on the harder difficulty. Just to see for you, is it worth it for one last time? Jumping in and doing this in your Bugatti. I'm so glad that I managed to time it so perfectly. Yeah, I'm such a god. The Grutu, baby. I think, obviously, they're now going to be, have already started probably on the next thing. And I want to say, like, from now, what my opinion is. Now that we've played the first episode of this update, and this is similar to how the other episodes are going to be along the way. Down right, I did. I'm grateful there's new events. I kind of wish there were more types of new events, more things to do, new play styles included. I appreciate the new vehicles because that's what that's what Forza is doing, for example. They're adding new cars and people love that. But the thing with Forza to me that I don't like is that there's nothing new to do with those cars. The crew did that all the time. And now that I've done this, I feel like I'm going to be doing the same again, but off road. Which is okay. I'm just more of a play style type of person. I want to play with different mechanics. I want to play with different themes and stuff. Of course, this feeds that a little bit, but not to the amount that I would want tremendously. I know what Ivory Tower are like, and I know what they can achieve. And of course, it's been a little bit difficult with the lockdown. I think France is going pretty badly into lockdown once again. So. I imagine a lot of this is from home, but I can I can be a young boy with big hopes and dreams. And that's what I'm, I'm going to be here and say that I hope for the next ones we have more different play styles. Because of course, this, this style of event is probably going to carry on over into episode two by the look of it, except we're going off road. And that's the... Funny, funny. Now, the thing I hope that really, really happens is that we got a Dodge Charger as part of the previous update, and that was available for what? That's right, Demolition Derby. I want to see another car added to the Demolition Derby, a licensed car added to that. I want to see a whole slew of cars added to the Demolition Derby because that means that we can do police chases properly. That definitely adds a gameplay element. That's what I was literally just talking about. Again, I'm not going to sit here and say that I don't appreciate the fact that they're still updating this game and updating it for free for the most part. Of course, you can buy the motor pass and get some of the cars with skins on them. And also, one of the cars is free anyway. The, the most important car on the next motor pass is completely free. So, I'm not going to sit here and complain. But, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. All right. We get ready for tomorrow, guys. The crew tool. And we're posting quite a bit of it. You already know. Be sure to smash like, subscribe if you are new. And I'll see you in the next video. And until next time, peace.